Hiya, baby. Yeah. Look, baby. Look, baby. Yeah, I know. Everyone's going to love that. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I've been seeing on Instagram recently these really beautiful peg photo frames. My mum's birthday coming up. I thought what a great way it would be to try and create my own, especially as in Hobbycraft right now, they do have a sale on their deep photo frames. This video is not sponsored in any way, but um, I just really love Hobbycraft. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed today's video. Okay, so I just had this pad that I got from Hobbycraft. It's 64 sheets no, of patterned card. And I just stuck that down to the reverse of the insert that you get with the frame with double-sided sticky tape. <laughs> Pardon you, Sia. And then I had these gold foam stickers anyway, which I originally got from Hobbycraft. I think they were just £1.50, but as you can see, you get a lot for your money. And I just spelled out the word love with it. The glue dots were actually, I think uh, they're from Poundland, and you get a hundred for a pound. And the wooden scrabble tiles were from Amazon. Again, I think you actually do get like a hundred or two hundred for ninety nine p or something. They're very affordable, and I just used the glue dots to stick them down. Then following that, I just used a bit of spare cardstock that I had and a fine tip sharpie um, in black to write out the word we. I did just do a little bit of um just extra decoration on it really just to make it a little bit more um enjoyable to look at and i cut it out and stuck it down with double-sided sticky tape again i'm not actually measuring out anything here i'm literally just putting them where i want them these uh f what are they called brush tip um metallic pens again we're originally from hobbycraft it's a bit of a hobbycraft haul today um but i just spelled out the word nan nan with them um, and you get, I think they were like seven ninety nine or something from Hobbycraft. And then just using the black pen again, I just went around and just um, put a little bit on the side just to give the word a bit more depth. I got this little heart embellishment, again from Hobbycraft, I think it was like a pound. And I just wrote out a little message on it for my mum because it was for her birthday. And then I had this jute twine already to hand and I just put, glued that on the back with some pegs. And that is basically it. Then once it's in the frame, this is how it looks. I'm really, really happy with how it turned out. As I said, it was for my mum's birthday and she really did love it. Okay, so there you have it. There is how I made the photo frame. I'm really, really happy with how it turned out. My mum loved it. Funnily enough, my granddad's birthday is actually the same day. So I made him a smaller birthday, um, a smaller frame for his 70th birthday. But yes, anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you are new. I'm, I hope my friend um, from Crazy Crafts doesn't mind that I'm doing a hobby craft uh, crafting video. Um, if you are watching and you feel like I've stepped on your toes, I'm really, really sorry. Um, but I'll, I'll link her site in below if anyone is interested because she does do some really great craft hauls. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.